Now we discuss about the photo or the perpendicular concept. It is very useful to JE and also for the state board exams. Here is the concept. The foot of the perpendicular drawn from the point x1 y1 to the line ax plus by plus c is equal to 0. If the line pq is perpendicular to the rs, q is called the foot of the perpendicular drawn from the point p. Now we first find the slope of a line pq. We know that the slope of a line segment joining x1 y1 x2 y2 is y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1. That means the difference of y coordinates by difference of x coordinates. The slope of pq is k minus y1 by h minus x1. Say it is m1. The slope of a line r is that is ax plus by plus c0 is minus a by b. Say it is m2. Since these two lines are non-vertical and perpendicular, the product of the slopes is minus 1. Hence, m1, m2 is equal to minus 1. Whereas, m1 is k minus y1 by h minus x1 into m2 is minus a by b. This is equal to minus 1. Minus minus gets cancelled. b into h minus x1 into 1. That is b into h minus x1. a into k minus y1. That is a into k minus y1. Transposing b onto the right side and a into the left side we get h minus x1 by a is equal to k minus y1 by b. Say this is lambda. h minus x1 by a is equal to lambda. h minus x1 is equal to a lambda. h is equal to plus x1 plus a lambda. k minus y1 by b is equal to lambda. k minus y1 is b lambda. Taking minus 1 into the so RHS, it bears a positive sign. So k is equal to y1 plus b lambda. Since the point q h comma k is a point on the line so a x plus b y plus c is 0 substitute the point in line equation we get a h plus b k plus c is equal to 0 but h is equal to x1 plus a lambda so a into x1 plus a lambda b into k is y1 plus b lambda plus c is equal to 0 a into x1 a x1 a into a lambda a square lambda b into y1 b y1 b into b lambda b square lambda plus c is equal to 0. So a square lambda plus b square lambda taking lambda is a common factor from these two terms a square plus b square into lambda so a x1 plus b y1 plus c is equal to 0. So a square plus b square into lambda is equal to taking this term into the LHS it gets the minus sign so minus of a x1 plus b y1 plus c lambda is equal to minus of ax1 plus by1 plus c by a square plus b square. Put the value of lambda in 1. So h minus x1 by a is equal to k minus y1 by b is equal to minus of ax1 plus by1 plus c by a square plus b square. This is one argument. Or from 1 we can use the, the ratio proportion method also. So from this step we can also argue like this h minus x1 by a is equal to k minus y1 by b is equal to using ratio and proportion so a into h minus x1 plus b into k minus y1 by a into a a square b into b that is plus b square so a h minus a x1 plus b k minus b y1 by a square plus b square now minus a x1 minus b y1 plus a h plus b k since the point h comma k lie on the line ax plus by plus c is 0, we have ah plus bk plus c is equal to 0. So ah plus bk is equal to minus c. Now we can write as minus ax1 minus by1 minus c by a square plus b square. Now taking minus 1 is common factor, that is minus of ax1 plus by1 plus c by a square plus b square. Here is the one example based on foot of the perpendicular concept. Find the coordinates of the foot of the perpendicular from the point 2, 3 to the line 3x minus y plus 4 is equal to 0. Here given point 2, 3. See this point is P 
and its coordinates being x1 y1 that is x1 y1 is 2 comma 3 given line is 3x minus y plus 4 is equal to 0 so a is 3 and b is minus 1 and c is equal to 4 q h comma k is the foot of the perpendicular drawn from the point p on the line 3x minus y plus 4 is equal to 0 foot of the perpendicular formula is h minus x1 by a is equal to k minus y1 by b is equal to minus of ax1 plus by1 plus a by a square plus b square h minus x1 is 2 by a3 that's equal to k minus y1 3 by minus 1 that's equal to minus of ax1 3 into 2 6 by1 minus 1 into 3 minus 3 plus c4 by a square plus b square that is 3 square 9 minus 1 whole square 1 this is equal to minus 7 by 10. H minus 2 is equal to 3 into minus 7 by 10. That is minus 21 by 10. K minus 3 is equal to minus 1 into minus 7 by 10. That is equal to 7 by 10. Hence, H is equal to take a minus 2 into the right side gets a positive. So, that is 2 minus 21 by 10. So, 10 into 2, 20 minus 21 by 10. That is equal to minus 1 by 10 k is equal to 3 plus 7 by 10 that is 30 plus 7 by 10 that is equal to 37 by 10. So, foot of the perpendicular q h comma k is h is minus 1 by 10 k is 37 by 10.